I'm Dr. Lauren Stryker. Your question is, does taking estrogen prevent wrinkles and all those other lovely skin changes that occur with the onset of menopause? I'm gonna give you the inside information. Now, I assume you've already watched my video on the impact of menopause on skin, so you know that the drop in estrogen that occurs with the onset of menopause is partially responsible for wrinkles and blotching and sagging. So of course, of course, if you take estrogen, it's gonna have a positive impact on your skin. But how much of an impact? Well, let's start with women that take systemic estrogen, which typically is taken to reduce hot flashes and protect bones. Now, multiple studies show that whether you use a transdermal or an oral estrogen, there will be a positive impact on skin. But having said that, the amount of estrogen that is in your body from taking a menopausal hormone therapy is nowhere near the amount of estrogen that your ovaries were pumping out before you went into menopause. So while women who take estrogen definitely tend to have less wrinkles and sagging and skin discoloration, taking estrogen will sadly not make your skin look like it did when you were 20. And honestly, the decision to use a systemic estrogen should probably be based on the positive impact it will have on your hot flashes, your bone, your brain, your bladder, your sex life, and your heart. The improvement in your skin, nice bonus, but it's probably not the reason to start. But what about if you apply estrogen directly on your face? I mean, we know that if you put estrogen directly on your vagina, it's gonna have a very positive impact. So it seems that it would be a good idea to put it directly on your face. Well, interestingly, in the 1950s, estrogen was added to face cream because of its known youth enhancing powers. Helena Rubinstein and Elizabeth Arden were the makeup mavens of the 1940s, and they knew that applying estrogen to the skin could help make up for the ravages of time in menopause. And estrogen was a main active ingredient of their face products. And modern studies confirm that a low dose estrogen cream applied to the face produces a significant increase in skin thickness, moisture, firmness, and yeah, a decrease in wrinkles. And interestingly, and expectedly, there's no increase in blood estrogen levels because the absorption is so minimal. But, but there are no face creams today that contain estrogen, and there's no FDA-approved estrogen product that's intended for facial use, and there won't be any time soon. So theoretically, can you apply vaginal estrogen cream to the face? Well, you could, but the skin on the face is not the same as the skin in the vagina, and these products have never been tested to see what the absorption is or how it will react with your skin. So probably not a great idea. It's possible to formulate a compounded estrogen cream that's in an appropriate base uh, to apply to the face, but as far as I know, there's no data on the approach and far be it for me to suggest such a thing. If you haven't already, please check out my video on what dermatologists recommend to improve your skin post-menopause. You'll also find lots more information 